Welcome back to this closet and thank you for tuning in to my channel if you are new I am all about DIY that is my main thing DIY tutorial from home craft fashion anything and as you can see by the title we are doing a flower headpiece I am so excited I've been meaning to do this for a while so I don't want to keep talking and talking let's get into this tutorial okay first i'm gonna quickly explain exactly what we need for this tutorial and obviously we're gonna start with the flowers we have to have the flowers like you can have any range of flowers um in your craft shop they actually sell the flowers in a bundle so what you can do you can just choose which a theme in terms of your headpiece if you want a red flowers or red roses or you want um, a multicolored uh, type of flowers and then you can just choose so where I bought um, it was a China mall where I bought my flowers they were ranging from around 36 rand to 9 rand and the bigger the flower the more um, it will, it's not expensive but the bigger the flower you'll find that it's around 80 bucks 100 bucks um, and then the smaller ones you'll find them at around 12 rand 29 rand and so on So the first thing you need is those flowers. You need your headpiece or your headband um, Depending on which one you want. I'm gonna use these ones and then um, I have my flowers I have this cutter and The scissor as well in case I do need it and then I have a glue Yes, it's the cold glue and I see here it's written wood glue, but it says it also does for cardboard uh, paper um, Wood as well. It's ideal for DIY and craft projects and I'm gonna need a tape because I might need to put these together because I want uh, my headpiece to be a bit uh, Thicker here so that I can be able to add all my flowers and make it nice and full so without wasting any further time let's start with this DIY as you can see I am putting the two headbands together I started by using the cold glue but because the cold glue takes a bit longer to dry we are actually using a tape to actually secure the two headbands I'm using two headbands to actually make my headband a bit thicker so that we can be able to accommodate all the flowers and make our headband a bit fuller as you can see my favorite part I'm actually arranging these roses and the flowers to actually give myself an idea of how I want my headband to actually look so I would advise that if you want to do um, a headband first plan it before you start gluing because once you start gluing you can actually change so you glue after you've planned already how you want your headband to look I will fast forward this video to make sure that we actually move faster and um, our video becomes a bit shorter okay as you can see now all my four roses are actually glued to the headband now what I'm gonna do I'm gonna add the white and the red small roses in between these uh, bigger roses just to add a bit of color and also more texture and more flowers DIY for today. I hope you enjoyed uh, doing this a uh, floral headpiece as much as I enjoyed doing it for you. And if you want to see more videos and have any suggestions on which DIY you'd like to see, please comment down below. Do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel so that you can always uh, get notifications every time I post a new video. And don't forget to click that notification bell. Otherwise, to my new subscribers, Thank you for joining this channel. It's not my channel. It's our channel. And to my returning subscribers, thank you for your support. Otherwise, see you next time on this closet. Mwah, mwah, mwah.